What's happening people, Scarfy's Personal Care, your daily Spurs the update for Tuesday the 16th of January 2024, so let's crack straight into it and start with our new signing, Radu Drogsin, uh, on your screen there. Um, yes, that is right, uh, I rejected Bayern, I chose Tottenham because I felt it was the right step for me and I had a really good conversation with the coach. I saw that they wanted me from a long time ago, like one month before the transfer window, so I thought this is the right choice for me. My dream was to play in the Premier League, I think the team here, the guys here, are on a good trajectory. I felt joining them can help me a lot. This is from Charlie Eccleshare via Athletic UK, and those are the words of Radu Drogsim uh, himself. Update now on Sergio Regulon. Brentford are advancing in talks to sign Sergio Regulon. Loan deal close to being agreed with Tottenham and it's now at the final stages. Discussions will follow on the player side waiting for Regulon decision. Several clubs are currently interested in reporting this is Fabrizio uh, Romano. Ryan Sessegnon has been informed that he does not feature in Ange Postacoglu's uh, long-term plans with Spurs. Uh, and Spurs are now willing to listen to offers of a former Fulham winger. Spurs are already willing to listen to offers for Brian Gill as well as Sergio Regular. This is from the Football uh, Insider, so it could be a lot more outgoings yet this window, not surprising at all. Tottenham Hotspur midfielder Rodrigo Bentegor covered more distance against Manchester United on Sunday's Premier League game, uh, 7.6 miles than any other player on the pitch for either team. Yves Basuma, um, Kickstarts uh, his AFCON 2023 journey today against South Africa. So wishing a good luck on myself, behalf of the channel, uh, to Basuma. Um, AS Roma confirmed this morning that Jose Mourinho uh, and his coaching staff have left with immediate effect. Obviously, ex Tottenham manager. And this morning, uh, before Roma announced the new manager, Antonio Conte rejected an approach uh, from AS Roma to replace obviously former Tottenham Hotspur manager Jose Mourinho reporting that was La Repubblica. Shin Min Son has won the Best Footballer in Asia Award uh, for 2023. Seven years in a row now he's done it. So congratulations to Shin Min Son. Tottenham manager Ange Postacoglu was keen on giving all members of the squad a clean state when he arrived. However, sources report that, he, that from his first meeting, Postacoglu had serious doubts about Jed Spence. Spence was said to have not taken well to Postacoglu's subsequent suggestion of another loan move. Postacoglu's response was to insist that he would not be part of the squad anymore, short or long term. Postacoglu has spoken repeatedly in public about prioritising the right sort of characters and felt that Spence was the wrong fit for the group. Uh, reporting this is James Olly via ESPN FC and that is your daily Spurs update for Tuesday the 16th of January 2024. I do hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button if it's your first time on the channel. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button because it's ultimately free to do so and it helps the channel grow. So that would be massively appreciated. Thank you. Um, keep up to date you know, by turning that notification bell on number one place for Tottenham transfer news and updates. Keep you up to date throughout this window until it slams shut on the 31st of January. But as we were saying on the channel, up the spurs.